Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon. I've done some thinking, and I've realized things, and also stuff. How's it going, Gabby? Pretty good. Yeah, but I have realized that the cloche may not be our ticket to happiness. So we're going to work on getting phytogenic insulators and generally advancing in thermal instead of in immersive. So we're going to use a little bit of immersive. But, uh, oh, crap. Oh, crap. But, uh, yeah, we're going to, we're going to get a power base of thermal before we do much else. Okay, and I'm currently very complicatedly building a portal. <laughs> Oh, are you doing it, like, down there? What? Are you building the portal down there? Yeah, I figure we don't want it up here. Okay. Uh, and do be careful, it is an absolute mess up here. By, and by up here, I mean down here. Oh, I see what you already placed on the block. Yes. Yes, I see. You see the cunning plan I've done. Yeah. Uh, be careful, there's still a lot of lava. Yes. Oh, crap. I don't know where I am or what I'm doing, but it's apparently working. Oh, was I not supposed to break that one? Uh, as long as it's not obsidian, you can break it. Well, I mean, yeah. The obsidian would take five minutes to break it. Yeah. yeah. As long as it's not obsidian, go ahead and break So I think we just need the base now. You got one to steal on you? Yes, I've prepared. Hey, you ready to go with me? Yeah. It's adventure time. That's the time. Whoa! Look at that spawn. Yeah. We are right by the the bastion. Make sure you mark the portal home. Okay. I hate that map isn't good. Alright, the main thing we are here for is glowstone. Which I, gosh dang this, which I see some of over here. Oh, you already found some? Yeah, not a ton, but we don't need it. Those were the days. The days of a bastion. Hi. Hi, Piglin. I don't want you here. Oh, yeah, those piglins are not going to be happy. Oh, God. Yeah, they hurt. That's not even the, the melee ones. That's the main ones that are hurting. Uh, let's see. What else do we need from the nether? We can also use a little bit of nether quartz, but you know that's that's not a that's not urgent. That's another quartz for. Another what? What's the nether quartz for? Uh, eventually. It's nothing urgent. I probably should have worn like 
any kind of armor coming in here. Well, my pickaxe broke after one hit. Oh, you should go home and get a new one. Yeah, probably. Hopefully I can make this jump. Otherwise, I am, uh... Mm. Yeah, okay. I'm not in a good situation. I'm not in a good situation. Do you not have building blocks? I do have building blocks. Oh god, there's a giant pig trying to slaughter me. How did he... Why is he not dead? I, uh... I do not have any answer for you. Okay, pillaring up. Pillaring up. I'm scared. I am going to die in here. I can tell you that. I tell you what, I'm gonna die in here. Oh, it's a brute! It's a brute! That's not fun. Let's take a quick nap. Okay. Uh, but yeah, so we... All we really need is a little bit of glowstone. At least from the nether. I should break some building blocks with me and a pick. You know what we're low on? Cobblestone. I cannot hear you if you're saying words. Oh, I said I got a stack and a half. Oh, I mean, I've got like half a stack, but it's like, I'm used to having so much more cobblestone. Let's go get our corpses back. Well, oh, I didn't leave the corpse. Did you fall in lava? Oh yeah, you made it out. I made it out, yes. I left a corpse there. I'm, I died. I have perished. Where did you fall? I didn't. I got stabbed by a piglin. <laughs> Behind you. Oh, I saved you. Thank you. Explore very carefully. There are tons of big ones. Yeah, maybe we should not. Yeah. I'm just gonna. This run. is a brute. Yeah, that brute killed me. Ooh, nickel! Oh god, I'm dying. I think I saw some bees. I think we are underprepared. Ah, crap. Nah. Well, hey, our first melon grew. That's good. Yeah. All right. You know what? I don't think I had anything important on me. Like, I think the most important thing was a pipe wrench. Uh, if you want to collect oh, yeah. my corpse, I just kind of ran past the bastion. But more importantly, if you can grab some glowstone. Uh, you ran past the bastion. Yeah, like I. Oh, the other direction. Yeah. Um. Also, I would love to grab some glowstone, but I don't know where it's at. Um, I haven't seen any since coming in here. Look. Uh, I mean, I know where it comes from, I guess. Alright, so... I'm gonna start working towards... In, in 
induction smelter. Because we're definitely going to need one of those. Yeah. I'm going to try and get some glowstone. Without dying. Yeah, not dying is the best. Not dying is preferable. To, uh, you know, dying. I will survive. There's some glowstone over there, but it's a little ways away. How do I always get stuck on the adventures? Because <laughs> I'm a homebody. I'm, I'm here building our house, and you're out there adventuring. When are you going to have time to come home? <laughs> it's scared easy, though. All right. Definitely need to run that time a little bit. How much less time? How much glowstone do we need? Uh, not a ton. Like, obviously the more the better, but if, if you can get half a stack, that's probably fine. A metric ton. Yes. How much does glowstone weigh? I don't, I don't think much. I mean, stuff in Minecraft can be pretty heavy. Like, imagine how much Steve, how much it, how much it would weigh if Steve had a full backpack of just stone. I think the heaviest thing you can get in vanilla would be just stacks of anvils. Like, imagine carrying a whole backpack full of nothing but anvils. Blocks of iron. It's... Well, no, because an anvil is three blocks of iron. What I did have buckets on me, and those are kind of valuable at this stage. I, I couldn't find your corpse. We'll get it eventually. I'll be honest, I gave up on that venture pretty that, quick. That's fine. That's fine. The pigments were swarming the big bastion, and I left that bastion. Oh! Did you just die again? I'm about to. Okay, I survived. Yay, not dead. Thought that is preferable. I'm just trying to get out now. I don't blame you. I hear things behind me. It's I'm on the run. You're on the lamb. The law's after you. I'm building up. Okay, whatever it is, I outran it. Okay. Can you come home? I need some cobblestone. I am on my way. I'm on my way. <laughs> I like how that's what I'm out of. It's cobblestone. I got all the metals I need. I'm just out of cobblestone. All well, the pickaxe. Oh, the money is done. I don't have any sticks. It's called Minecraft, not craft. It's called Minecraft, <laughs> not, not wait for your honey to come get you, craft. Hold on. I'm trying to figure out how to get out of where our portal's at. Uh, it's like a straight shot away from the lava. Uh, I don't see lava here. But okay, I found it. Yeah. I found it. I can't believe I got lost just two feet from the door. I, started, I, I don't want to build a wooden pick, because wooden picks stink, but I, I don't have any stone. Here. Here. I got a little bit. There. I don't have a lot. What do you need it for? Uh, a furnace to make an induction smelter. Uh, do you need the glass one? Uh, just come put it in the valuables chest. Because I need to make the, uh... I risk my life for it. <laughs> You're not even going to use it. Let me make myself a quickie picky. Another work block. Can I... 
get another I, wart out. It's difficult to actually turn back into another wart, though. So it's difficult, you said. Yeah, how, like I, I don't know of any easy way to turn it back into another wart. Oh, and a crusher. You what? And a crusher. I'm surprised the pulverizer doesn't do it. Yeah. Um. LV. Alright, so we got an induction smelter. I'm gonna make a quick LV capacitor. Oh, something's going slow. Did, did we crash? Okay. I, oh, that's no, just no, my brain. Okay, my just brain goes spike. slow. Just a lag spike. Yeah, I'm going to make an LV capacitor. So that... Mm. Oh, no, there's my hammer. I'm going to need some treated wood, and I made the treated wood off camera just because it's, it's pretty big. It's just the creosote from our coke oven and the stuff. And the, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Stuff and the things. Stuffing things and other things. So, input, output, output. All right. In theory, we should be able Zero, to just I... stick food in here. Zero F. It's charging the induction smelter. So this is working. This is a power battery. Oh, okay. And we... I don't know how much it holds, though. It ain't charging the pull frame. That's because it's doing the smelter first. You can only do one at a time. Uh, that's just how the programming works. Okay. So, we have all the infrastructure we need. Now we just need some phytogenic insulators. Okay, so for that, we're going to need lumium. Which is tin, silver, and gold. We want two of these, so we need eight, sixteen. Oops, Why did sorry. you hit me? I was trying to pick up a torch. <laughs> I was trying to pick up a torch and I murdered you. That was on the wall. And I was swinging a sword. Because that's what I had out. That, that's fair. It happens. So let's see. So we need. I was just shooting torches off the wall for my gun. So we need eight. So it turns out we only needed eight glowstone. I was trying to change my kid's dirty diaper by shooting the tabs off of its diaper with the gun, and I accidentally shot it. <laughs> I can't see it, but I'm shaking my head. <laughs> it's basically the same thing that just happened. Basically. Then, let's see. Um, okay, we got some wood. That is good, because we have wood. We're going to need another pipes wrench, but that's really easy to make. It's literally just two sticks and two flint. Stick, two flint. No, uh, just stick, stick some flint in the input chest for the pulverizer, because that, it uses them.
Do you have cheese? I have a little bit. Okay. Uh, just cause we we are currently still not good on power. So if you got spare food and you want to stick it in the in the food cruncher, that wouldn't be a bad idea. We we are approaching goodness though. Flesh doesn't work. Rotten flesh does not work. We should probably just stick a hopper in front of that, honestly. Well, let's not do that because we won't we won't be doing that for long. Okay. So the induction smelter has finished. Uh, can you get some more sand while you're out? I can get some more sand. Thank you. How much more sand? Uh, a lot. We're gonna need glass. Decent chunk of it. Okay. I don't know of any deserts. We got a beach near us. They're a prismarine bee nest. Ooh, that sounds cool. I thought it was like some weird crafting bench thing, but now just another type of bee nest. The bees, the bees all over the town. For our the bees, bees, they are white, and our bees, they are brown. They are bees, the bees' knees. Try to get at least 16 sand, because then we can use a whole cold coke for it. Oh, I have 28. Alright, go ahead and bring that back. Bring home the bacon. The bacon's being brought home. Have no fear, the bacon is here. Breaking the bacon. I don't like bacon. You don't? No. Fair enough. I am a I'm a picky eater. <laughs> Go ahead and stick it in the furnace. The weirdest thing that I'm picky about, I'm picky about hamburgers. I don't like hamburgers that much. That's fair. Alright. I don't like eggs either. So like breakfast is like bad for me. <laughs> Do we have time in a bottle? Time in a bottle? Oh, we do <gasps> No, we don't. Uh, time in a bottle is the best tick accelerator. What it does is you leave one in your inventory, and it accumulates time, and then you can spend that time in order to, uh, to, like, increase your, uh, to, to tick accelerate blocks for, like, 30 seconds at a time. Get time to spend time. Yes, it's actually really cool. Right, then we're gonna need some fluid points. Fluid points? For borp. We should probably set up the create infinite iron farm sooner rather than later. Do you have a bucket on you?
Where do you want to set up our power base? Like just just outside our house, or? Gabby? Maybe that. What? Huh? Where do you Can want you to hear set me? Up? What? I did not hear you. Oh, I said yeah, that works. Maybe like well, this way. I'll, I'll take advantage of this natural little lake here, and set up right. Right. No. Here should be good. Yeah. Yeah, because these... Thank you. So these are going to grow our plants. Uh, you need to set the back to input. They will fill with water. So you... Yep, so we just need some seeds now and some berries. Seeds and berries. They're gonna need power, but that's a later thing. Alright, so then we need... Okay, can you look up the sequential fabricator in JEI? Or NEI or whatever it is now? Okay. Alright. See about building just one of those. Just one of those, huh? Just that's one. I think that's possible. It doesn't require any copper, and copper is our biggest. We, we got some copper. It does require six. And I think, yeah, we got a little more copper dust. I'm smelting it now. Do we have any more gold? Fudge baskets. It just needs one gold, right? Yeah. Gosh, dingus. This might take a while. Yep. Uh, <laughs> gra grab some copper while you're out, because we're going to need more copper for the gears. I don't. For what? The for, for not the for the fabricator. That's an important step to automate this. Oh, does it need eight? It needs eight because it needs two copper gears, and each of those are eight. Do we have eight? Uh, we have four, and I need some of those. So just grab as much copper as you can while you're out. Well, copper doesn't spawn at the same layer as gold. I believe in you. I, I have, have no good way of my fingering. I do want to try to get this fully automated before... I know, I'm trying. <gasps> oh! We have energy pipes. Oh, that requires a lot of redstone. That's fine. We can get redstone. No, redstone's but I, I've already made some... some capacitors, so... Yeah, that's fine, too. Okay, so you will output... Each of these sides output input input output output So I've got power kind of running. Uh, 
gold is proving true. They each use 20. That's good. Uh, yeah, we're, we're definitely going to need to manually feed this for a little bit before it properly automates itself. But once we get a sequential fabricator, we... I found a lot for a second. <laughs> I almost died. Okay, so once we get a sequential fabricator to make sweet berry cookies, we should be pretty dang good in terms of power and food. Good team. Oh, no, that was not work. That was actually my mom. Usually work is only people that, like, send me actual text messages. I get you. So, the quickest way of getting gold is not an option to me. Uh, going to the nether? No. Uh, well, I mean, that would be quicker, I guess. But that also isn't an option. I'm not doing that. Um, yeah. going through the cave and finding it in the cave because, uh, I'm almost dead and I don't have any feet. Yeah. And then... So now I'm stuck just strip mining and hoping. We're so close. I can almost taste it. We're also 30 minutes into the episode. But it's like, gosh darn it, I want to... You know what? Uh, yeah. We'll be back in a little bit once we have just a few more materials. I will finish this build this episode. Alright, so we are Upper back. Simple. Gabby is putting together our sequential fabricator, which should then let us do the ding dang dangle ding. I'm gonna grab a little more wood while you're doing that. Because okay. we're gonna want some storage of items and whatnot. It'll be so nice to have unlimited food and power. And by unlimited power, I mean limited power, but at least constant generation. Yeah. And we can augment those, uh, those things. We'd probably want to do more fuel efficient rather than more power per tick. Just because we it cost about 40,000 RF to make one of eight sets of the rolls and the rolls only produce like 50,000 RF. You only want one. Only one sequential fabricator. Correct. Good. We both use the crafting table at the same time. I think we can. Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm outside. Just behind the base. Alright, so you go there. You want... Berries. wonder if we're out of wheat. 
always a question I have. Do we have... Okay, we got a little wheat. My obituary is uh, a valuable, right? I don't want you to be dead. <laughs> All right. All right. So it's making the items. It's making bacon. Um, I, yeah, let's just take that there. Um, then we need to set these guys to output. We need to let them run again, but mm, we kind of need to build up our power first. But, all right, so I'm just going to run you guys... Through. Hmm. We're, we're gonna need so eventually this is gonna overflow with its materials. But for the moment well, that's going to take a little while, isn't it? Yeah. But so, so this makes, turns seeds into wheat and seeds. This turns berries into more berries. This... Hmm. Takes the berries and the wheat, so it needs something to do with the wheat seeds. Yeah, so the wheat seeds, we, we can, they're just kind of going to fill up for a little bit. We also need to make sure that it feeds itself before it feeds the sequential fabricator. So we might need... Uh, cyclical processing. That's what it's called. No, okay, it looks like it feeds itself just fine. I think it's gonna take care of. Yeah. So, in theory, this should just run and run and run, building up power and uh, sweet berry cookies. And, yeah, um, we're going to need to add overflow for seeds, wheat, berries, all that stuff. But we will handle that later. For now, see you guys later. Bye.